Well, our guineas are about seven weeks old and today's the day we're gonna let them out of their barn here for the first time. They've never been out just to free range on the property, so today's the big day. We have a new animal coming to the homestead later today that we need to use this barn for, so uh, you'll be seeing that in just a little bit later in this video. Let's let these guys out. Well, this isn't working. It's been 20 minutes and they just haven't come out. So it's time to uh, take matters into our own hands. Oh my gosh. Bye. I guess it's not part of the group. You couldn't have seen the group? I don't know. They apparently don't care about him. Look at the ducks. They're like, what are those? Let me show you what we have in the dehydrator. We're mostly using it to dehydrate sweet cherry tomatoes so that we can use them um, as sun-dried tomatoes over the winter. Some green beans. These are cayenne peppers and then paprika peppers. More peppers and tomatoes. These are the black burn. The other ones were the egg yolk. They're super sweet, um, and uh, so Kevin and Samantha don't like to eat as many of them. It looks like the rest of these are just tomatoes. So all of these are dry. Now I can fill it back up with new stuff. This area of our kitchen has become a staging area for processing, canning, dehydrating, that kind of thing, cooking. So as we bring things in from the garden, they actually kind of stay in boxes in our middle room and then come in here as we're gonna work on them. Uh, last week, we picked a bunch of peppers and I picked a bunch of jalapeno peppers thinking that I could bring them in the house and let them go red and fully ripen in the house. And then I could do various things with them that I want to with red jalapeno peppers, but that really hasn't been the case. The jalapenos actually have just started to uh, shrivel a little bit. Uh, only a couple of them have started to turn red. So instead, I'm going to can them. I'm gonna do two different recipes. Samantha and I are gonna work on pickling all of these jalapenos. We're gonna do two different recipes. One is just a standard pickled jalapeno recipe, and the other is a recipe that was sent to us from a subscriber. It's called Cowboy Candy, which is sweetened jalapenos but also pickled so we're going to try that out we're super excited we have a lot of jalapenos <laughs> so 
Samantha has decided to make lunch for us today. What do you make? I'm gonna make a pasta salad with two tomatoes, um, a half of an onion, and just a little bit of yellow squash, and some bell pepper, and then vinaigrette. A vinaigrette, and which then, you're gonna make. Yes, I'm gonna make the vinaigrette, mm -hmm. and then I'm gonna boil some noodles. Okay. Mm -hmm. Cool. Teach her how to cook. Looks good. Okay, let me show you the new addition to the homestead. So today we went and picked up eight quail. Um, we raised quail when we lived in Arizona, so we're gonna start raising them again here in Missouri because it's a good, sustainable, fast-growing meat source. Right now we have eight. These are gonna be, you know, for eggs and breeders to start with, and then we'll start uh, harvesting the young ones as we get more and more. These guys are about four weeks old right now, and they can start laying eggs in as little as two weeks. That's one of the advantages of quail, is that they start laying eggs super young, which means they can start reproducing super young. So we'll be getting the incubators out, and we'll be hatching a lot of these guys out for food. So here's the part of the video everybody's been waiting for. The winner of our contest for a 30,000 subscriber giveaway. Now remember, we're giving away a Alexa Pure Pro uh, water filter system. It's a gravity fed water system. Uh, it's what we use here on the homestead and it is awesome. We love it. The filters last for 5,000 gallons. Um, it's, it's an amazing filter. So here we go. Just a few minutes ago, we were in the house. We picked a random winner on the computer and the winner is... Hideaway Homestead. Yee -hee! Congratulations, we're so happy for you. You're gonna love this water filter. Um, here's what you need to do. You need to uh, send us an email with your contact information, your shipping address and all of that. We'll get the filter ordered and sent directly to you. So congratulations. It's been a great day on the homestead. It's just time for me to milk the goats so I can go inside and wind down for the day. Well, we had another productive day on the homestead and we're so glad that you joined us. If you like this video and if you enjoy our channel, right now is a perfect time to hit the subscribe button below. If you know someone who you think would like our channel as well, please share it on all of your social media. And until next time, thanks so much for stopping by the homestead. Take care and God bless.